Hey everyone, alright, well happy 4th uh, of July weekend and I actually have an unboxing to uh, get to. Um, I placed a fairly large, well, a large order with um, Jaeger's Poured Silver right before the Brexit vote and uh, I am definitely glad I did because you are looking at an order of about 181 ounces of uh, some of their new stuff and some of their older stuff and um, yeah, basically, uh, with the spot price going up as much as it did, this this order would cost me about four hundred fifty dollars right now more um, than what it did when I bought it. That spot has gone up so much. So uh, this package really good, but I have a lot to go through. So I already scored everything. So um, let me get this bad boy open. It's pretty heavy. Package extremely well. A box inside of a box. Inside of another box? Oh, okay, no. That's the cardboard. I was like, I didn't know there's another box. All right. Looks like I got some swag here. Um, that is awesome. Let me uh, let me get these all out real quick. Get this box out of the way. That's a lot of stuff. So excited I got that order in before the recent increase in spot price. This is awesome. Uh, he told me he's coming out with these. Um, I said, hell yeah, I want some of these. Some Jaeger's Port Silver Koozies. Um, he actually, for the through the 4th of July weekend, actually there is um, a promotion going on. If you place an order of $100 or more, um, you can get a free koozie. Uh, you have to put in the coupon code free koozie. I think that's what it is. I'll provide a link down, or I'll provide the information down below um, if everybody wants to place an order um, over the Fourth of July and get themselves a Jaeger Port Silver koozie. But that's awesome. Thanks, David. Um, oh, and also you'll see on uh, just for the Fourth of July, they have their uh, five ounce pyramids, uh, ten percent off. So, for those of you who've been looking, holding out to buy these, um, that really helps with the, you know, since the current spot price has gone up. So, let's take a look and see what other goodies I got. Oh, wow. That is awesome. Dang, he hooked me up. I got a Wheelers for the Wounded t-shirt. That is awesome, 2016 Texas. Wow, I got that. I got two more koozies, Wheelers for the Wounded koozies, and an awesome sticker. Um, for those of you guys who don't know, I mean, I've, I've went over this before, but this is a charity that um, Jaeger's Poured Silver supports. And basically what they do is they take vets out for the day and uh, they feed them and they go off roading with them and they just give them a good time you know to help raise their spirits and get them out and about and it is an awesome awesome charity to give to i'm going to go ahead and provide a link down below guys to the um to to their website if anybody wants to give and jaeger's poured silver also sells um sells some bars where the proceeds actually go to the go to the charity and they sell them as the one ounce and two ounce uh wheelers for the wounded bars so that's another way if you guys want to give, you can um, pick up these bars and uh, get some silver while, while giving to an awesome, awesome charity. Okay, well this video is going to be a long video. Like I said guys, um, I have a lot of stuff to go through and I'm going to try to go faster. But thank you David, that was awesome man. I love it. Absolutely love it. Alright, let's get into the silver. Um, as the, many of you know, Jaeger Port Silver started coming out with uh, 
That is awesome. Take a look at this. Jaegersport and Silver started coming out with um, antiquing their stuff. And so, you know, I had to get a bunch of it. Love the antique stuff. And so I picked up 40. And they all come in these uh, little scully bags. I picked up 40 other antique skulls. And let's take a look at them. That is awesome. Love the antiqueness of them. Let me uh, compare it to the shiny ones for you guys. There you go. Here's the difference between the two. So this order is basically a whole bunch of antique stuff. Um, all their antique stuff because I wanted to pick some up and compare it and see what you guys think too. I love it. And the nice thing about it is there's no extra charge for his, him antiquing it. And that's, antiquing is a pretty large process that goes through. They actually have to dip it and then they have to buff it all out and everything like that. So it's, it's a pretty large process. And as you know, these actually do, uh, they do stand up. But yeah, I picked up 40 of them because I love the skulls and they look awesome antique. So let me, well, let me see if I can just, let's see, let's try this one next. <laughs> All right, so what I picked up was, I picked up fifth, or, uh, 10 of the 50 gram uh, Plata Morota bars, and then 10 of their 25 gram ones that have been um, antiqued. And then I picked up five of their, their uh, arrowhead, their one ounce arrowhead. So I'm not gonna open all these up um, right, right now. Let me just stack them all up. So let me open some of these and compare them to uh, the shiny ones like I did the other stuff. And I can already tell you, I, love, I like them better. I love antique stuff. So excited they would start doing that. Been trying to talk them into it forever. Oh man, those are awesome. Yeah, there's there's no doubt in my mind. No doubt in my mind they are better than the, <laughs> the shiny. Let me see if... Okay, there's that. There's that. And, oh, there it is. And there's that. There we go, guys. Look at that. You know what, and I'm actually looking at it on the camera and it still isn't coming out. You can't see it quite as well, but in person, I'm telling you, they look amazing. They look so much better, all the details and stuff. I mean, and it looks like it looks like an older coin, you know, like th that's what these are supposed to look like. They're supposed to look like, you know, old rounds and coins and stuff like that. And they definitely uh, make it look uh, older, obviously, antiqued. So let's look at the other side and it just brings out so much more of the details. Absolutely loving these antique pieces. There we go, guys. But let me uh, let me keep going. I don't want this to be too long. You guys have stuff to do on this Fourth of July weekend, I'm sure. All right. Next up. <laughs> oh man, I just can't help but smiling. I cannot help but smile at this stuff. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. These are, I picked up three, three of the five ounce lions and three of the five ounce dragons. When my Silver Slacker Dragon came out, I really wanted it to be antiqued. I really, really did. Man, that is that is freaking awesome. That is just incredible. Let me show you guys the difference. Um, actually, let's do this. Let 
man, those are awesome. Take a look at that. Once again, it really isn't, sh I mean, in person, it looks incredible. I just hope that's coming through in the thing, because, yeah, I mean, they have, they're just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. They have, like, different, different, very slight hues of colors in them, too. So they're not just, you know, like, black or darker. There we go, guys. Awesome, awesome stuff. Man. That was bothering me. There we go. All right, next. Um, let's go with these. I bought 10 because I liked them so much. Oh, they're five ounce, five ounce Eagles. They're 4th of July Eagles. And I've actually, that was actually their first uh, antique stuff that I bought. And I already, I already bought, I already had some of those. But here's a comparison between those. Once again, no doubt. Love the details. The eye looks amazing. A lot more work goes into that antique, and I'm just excited that he don't charge any more money for it. So, all right, let's put those down. And lastly, he actually has a new bar. Just showed up on his website. Luckily, he let me uh, order them early um, because I, I told him I was going to be placing a large order, and I wanted these included. I just wanted to make sure I got my order in before the Brexit, like I said. And... I got one kilo worth, so I got 10 of their 100 gram, look at that, 100 gram, um, uh, the Plata Morta rounds, bars, whatever you want to call them, rounds, <laughs> I guess they're in a category of their own, they're not really around, but let's just go with that. Take a look at those. Once again, <laughs> amazing, amazing, love. I'm just giddy, guys. I am freaking giddy. I'm so freaking happy right now. Look at that. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Man, they do a great job there. So, All right, let me uh, compare just so you guys can uh, compare the size. There you go. There's the three sizes now. All right, guys. A hun another 100 and, um, 181 ounces added to the stack. And uh, really stoked that I got my order in when I did. As far as what, you know, people ask me what they what I think spot price is going to do. Um, I have no idea what it's going to do in the short term. I really don't. I don't think anybody does. Your guess is as good as mine. Um, all I know is in the long run, um, it's going up. You know, I have a longer term outlook than anybody else. I don't, I'm not much of a flipper. I flip things here and there. Um, here and there when, you know, they go up in premium a ton or something like that. But besides that, I'm a, I'm a long term hold. Um, and uh, I think that uh, these prices are still, you know, fine for long term but as far as short term it could go back down to $17 next week who knows but or it could jump up to 25 bucks no idea but uh, all I know is I'm picking up some awesome silver that I enjoy and that's the key buy stuff you like I buy stuff that I like and uh, I'm proud to have this stuff in my collection so all right guys um I will get all that stuff out of their bags and stuff and get it all put away but uh yeah Here's the overview, and obviously it's not all gonna fit in my treasure chest, and that's why I had to start buying some monster boxes, because I can't stack my treasure chest, so. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, once again, uh, please have a great and safe 
4th of July holiday, and I actually have another large unboxing, actually, I think larger than this one, um, coming. I should have that one soon. So, uh, all right, guys, please like, comment, subscribe, and um, have a great weekend.